Hey everyone, what's going on? It is Cedric Blitz or Justin, and welcome back to my top five Skywars players of the week. Guys, um, if you missed last week's episode, definitely click or tap the top right of the screen now and go watch it. You will definitely enjoy them. But before we get into this video, I want to mention I am picking the clips and making this video Tuesday night as opposed to Thursday night. So um, if you submitted any clips between a Tuesday night until Friday, um, they were not looked at whatsoever because I am going on that LA trip. And I have to make this video in advance because um, I'm going to be there Friday. And this video goes live Friday, so I can't really make it while I'm there if, if you catch my drift. So um, I do apologize. All of those submissions will be looked at for next week. And if they're outdated at that point, I will still include them because of this issue. But hopefully you guys will enjoy this video. Nonetheless, if you do, drop a like, subscribe, and of course, share this video around. Can we hit 2,000 likes on the episode like we always do, guys? I would highly appreciate it. You can clearly always do it. I appreciate the support, guys. I truly do. Um, and yeah, without further ado, let's hop into your honorable mentions. Up first, we have Memes Overload over here playing on the map overfall getting saved by the enemy's water surprisingly like that is some pretty rare stuff right there the player jumps over and he ends up killing the player to make it all the more funnier Next up, we have Pika Overlord throwing one egg, getting one kill. Throwing one more egg, getting one more kill. Very lucky. He has one egg left. Keep that in mind. So um, he's going on a killing spree in this game, throwing that pearl, knocking this player straight off the map. This is teams, which means there is absolutely zero strength kills happening right now, um, which is always, always impressive. So gets that next kill, throws his very last egg, um, and picks up the three for three on the egg kills, and then, of course, kills that person's teammate as well. And last Lastly, we have Baby Raps getting a very insane combo on this player in rank. going to be going straight into a very, very, very clutch Ender Pearl as well, um, which really puts the icing on the cake for this clip, especially that player lagging back right there, which probably made all this happen. Um, this is an honorable mention just because they do have a lot of music in the background, which I already cut out, but also some Pearl editing as well, which I'm not a fan of, but still a really insane clip. Good job. So at your number five spot for this week, we have 06. I'm sure I'm saying the name wrong. You guys know how it works. Getting trapped in this person's island, throwing the pearl, glitching in a block, managing to actually stay alive through that trap, which is always insane when you survive a trap. He's pretty much half glitched into the ceiling right now, which is weird. Drops down on the trapper, and the trap E becomes the killer because he gets this kill, um, which is always impressive when you win off of getting trapped. At number four, we have a fruit starting us off with a very nice Ender Pearl clutch, going for the block clutch, but they actually glitch inside the wall. So they just place the water. Very, very nice, very simple, very easy. And always cool to see a clip start with a pearl a clutch or a block clutch, either one of them. Proceeding to completely destroy this player right here, flawless. And then using strength, getting the very next kill. They go to actually make a tremendous through diamond sword. And in the clip, you can actually hear him talking about how it's going to be top five. So he wants to get kills and wants to win him. And that is exactly what he does. Using the pearls, making it a very fast paced game. Almost failing the next pearl he uses, which would have been very funny and ironic. But doesn't matter. Gets behind this player, knocks them off the map. Of course, this is going to give him strength yet again. So he pearls in, takes advantage, get one kill, and then grabs the very last kill to pick up the seven kill game with the pearl clutch. And at your number three spot for this week, we have Fire Elemental playing some more Ranked Scholars because that's what 90% of my clips are. And notice he has one Ender Pearl in his hot bar slot. Pay attention to that. He proceeds to destroy this player, hitting him clear off the map. He gets off the map. That player leaves, give him a Pearl, Pearl twice, and clutches and survives. That player leaving the game um, basically made this clip. That is so, so very cool. Um, and of course, he proceeds to win with three kills, which puts the icing on the cake. At your number two spot for this week, we have Matty T dying at the very beginning of this clip, which is probably confusing to you, but it spawns a spider, which he then uses to grab a lot of kills. So he picks up one right here, really showing how overpowered the spider can be if you stay in the game. He makes it spawn behind the next player, knocking him off the map, picks up two kills with the spider. It's a 1v1. He puts the spider behind one of the players, knocking them off the map, getting three spider kills, and then ending the game. I love the revenge spider. It is so overpowered. I loved this clip. 
But at your number one spot for this week, we have Unbanning picking up one kill and then almost getting clean. I got a getaway and some very, very nice escape tactics and movements here in this clip. One of the best parts about it is how he's moving him, how he's placing his blocks, where he's going, just how he's getting away and escaping him as a whole is just awesome because he has pretty much no health. He gets lagged back and then hit back over. So the player actually saves him with the lag back, which was incredibly lucky. And Finally, he is able to pick up his potion of healing in his inventory and is able to actually fight yet again because this whole time he's had no health. What would have been the point in fighting with two hearts to your name? And there would have been no point. So he finally goes in, actually starts showing off his PvP skills and pretty much destroys this player. They're kind of in the similar health range still though, but he is still absolutely winning this fight. Gonna go loot the chest a little bit, grab the pearls, grab the Pro 2 diamond pants to really make sure he's gonna win this game. And the player falls off the map anyways, so he wins regardless. Very nice clip. And there you have it. Those are your top five Skywars plays of the week for this week. Hopefully you did enjoy. If you did, drop a like, subscribe, and of course, share this video around. I would highly appreciate that, guys. Um, I want to reiterate, I am making this video Tuesday night as opposed to Thursday night. So if you guys do submit clips between Tuesday night until Friday and they're outdated come next week, I will still include them if they do make it in the top five. Um, if they're good enough at that point so do not worry do not fret if you did submit some they are still there they will still be looked at but if you guys do want to submit your clips for this series click the link down below and a few of the rules just they can't be no longer than two weeks old besides that uh small stipulation i mentioned them i try and make sure it's just the clip no full-on videos no full-on live streams make sure there's no editing no music crazy things like that and that's really it some pretty basic rules hopefully you guys do get in good luck to all of you submitting them and other than that i will talk to you all later I'm gonna say, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Peace out. Yo, thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, yo. If you haven't already, click the bell. Let me hear it go ding a ding a ding bell. Uh, if you haven't clicked the bell, what are you waiting for? You're never gonna get an email. Oh, snap. Bars. Thanks for watching. Bye.